cartels in America, certainly not a diminishing problem. Several agencies busting another drug cartel ring, trafficking fentanyl and heroin into Oklahoma. That's pretty far from the uh, Mexico line. The Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics says they recovered more than 10 pounds of heroin and over 14,000 fentanyl pills, arresting dozens of people. This comes as the state deals with one of the nation's largest increases in fentanyl deaths. One could say this is one of the biggest problems facing our generation. Jorge Ventura is live for us this morning. Jorge, I know they spent more than a year investigating this drug trafficking ring just to crack down. Jorge? That's right, Adrian. A 16-month investigation finally comes to an end as the Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics and several other law enforcement agencies shut down a major fentanyl and heroin trafficking network. This is out of Oklahoma City. Law enforcement officials tell News Nation that this investigation targeted a drug trafficking organization out of Oklahoma City that was moving heroin and fentanyl from Mexico to Oklahoma City with a reach across the nation. Authorities seized 10 pounds of heroin and over 14,000 fentanyl pills trafficked into the Sooner State. The investigation started in January of last year through several undercover operations in which purchases of fentanyl pills and packages of heroin were made. Authorities were able to identify and arrest multiple traffickers linked to this enterprise. Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics spokesperson Mark Woodward spoke to News Nation about the involvement of Mexican cartels. We've been able to identify who these people are. Um, who their contacts are, where they're, they're getting their drugs, and, and they're ordering them from Mexico. Um, the cartels are bringing them across the border, getting them to their suppliers on this side of the border, which gets them to their uh, suppliers here in Oklahoma. And then ultimately, those shipments are broken down and, and reach the streets throughout our state. Oklahoma is a key drug trafficking state for Mexican cartels for its two major highways, the I-35 and the I-40. One runs north and south, the other east to west, giving cartels access to many other states with Oklahoma City serving as a crossroads for drug trafficking routes. Cartels then sell large shipments of fentanyl to major dealers in Oklahoma City who then supply lower level dealers across the state and beyond. Oklahoma had the second largest increase of fentanyl deaths out of all the 50 states Last year, in 2022, over 1,000 people died of an opioid-related death in Oklahoma. That's a 22% increase from the year prior. Dealers lace drugs like heroin or counterfeit painkillers with fentanyl, and many times this is unknown to the, per to the person purchasing these drugs, resulting in an overdose death. Law enforcement sources in Oklahoma telling the News Nation that they are still working on several other investigations relating to Mexican cartels moving drugs into the Sooner State. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.